Hey guys, so today I actually decided that I was going to do Vlogmas. So basically, um, I've uploaded two vlogs for Thanksgiving. I separated them because they were really long. I didn't want to have like a 40 minute vlog up on my channel. And then I was like, wait, I upload two videos in a day. Why don't I just, I mean, in a row, why don't I just go ahead and go along with Vlogmas? So technically, this will be Vlogmas day three. So I wanted to um, talk about how I cracked my iPhone. I'm so mad right now, and it's just like a story that's not even my fault, technically. I mean, it is my fault, but like, it wasn't. So, I'm gonna open up these cartons because it's really dark, and I just wanna tell you guys this little quick story, because, I don't know, I, I go to school every day, so I don't really have um, an interesting life to vlog. But if I do vlog, hopefully it will be interesting. Here's my phone. doesn't look cracked at all. It's only cracked right here, and it's terrible cracked here. Let me try and focus. Oh, there it is. Let me there it is. It's all in the corner, and the rest of the phone is perfectly fine. Just right there in that corner. So let me talk about it. So when I'm filming this right now, it happened yesterday during lunch. So basically after lunch, you know, I was walking down the hallway, and I wasn't paying attention, and I was wearing these flip-flops. You're probably wondering, actually, why are you wearing flip-flops in December? I don't know. I wanted to. And so everything was going good until lunch, and then I slipped and fell and I almost did the splits and then, like this one guy he was just staring at me like he knew it was gonna happen and I was just like okay so um I was like that did not just happen like I know that's gonna be Abby and I was like that did not just happen she just started laughing and I was like oh my god I was so embarrassed I ran straight into the bathroom and I was like I feel like nothing happened didn't realize my phone was cracked till I got to class so I told my friend everything that happened and how embarrassing it was and I got to class and I looked at my phone and I was like oh my god I cracked my phone and it wasn't even my fault because basically I was walking and I had my lunchbox and my phone in my hand and then I, when I slipped my phone slammed on the ground in my hand obviously so that's how it cracked and I'm so mad about this because it wasn't my fault and my friend told me that she actually saw who spilled the drink because basically this dumb boy was trying to throw a soda bottle into the trash can and he missed and it exploded and it was on the floor and I slipped in his soda. So don't do dumb things like that because stuff like this will happen and it freaking annoys the crap out of me. People in my school are so damn childish and just annoying. But yeah, also today, let me just give you a reflection of my day. First period, we had this little um, mentor thing and my mentor is awesome. I actually opened up a lot and I didn't like it the first time. I didn't like my mentor, I just didn't like what we had to do and basically today we like first we said to do blah, blah, blah. <laughs> first we started off with two truths and a lie and i my two truths were um that i have scoliosis and i make youtube videos and my lie was i have two brothers i actually have one brother so um um she actually thought that i had a youtube channel was a lie and i was like oh no i actually do have a youtube channel and i don't know i think it's a good idea to like kind of just tell people um I don't know, but um, she actually was like, oh my god, what's your YouTube channel? And she's like, what do you do? And all that stuff. She's like, I'm looking you up when I get home. And I was just like, okay. Um, so she's prob she might not be watching this video, but she is watching my vlog channel. If you are, hey Shelby, how you doing? Um, I don't talk this much at my mentor meetings, but I, I talk to a camera and it's normal. So yeah, um, that was fine. Second period, my teacher got on my freaking nerves. He is so annoying. Everyone hates that teacher, first of all, and um, it's English. If you are going to my school, I don't want to say his name now, but it's English. And basically, um, I'm, okay, so I did my homework. This last night was probably the first time I actually read a full chapter in English and I actually comprehended it because I hate reading and I don't want, I don't like reading. And so I was like, oh, um, I answered all the I, I answered all the questions but one. I wasn't answering the one question that I didn't answer. He doesn't like you doing your his homework in class and he likes to talk a lot. So I'm like, whoa, why would I listen to you when I can just like you know add some more stuff to it? Because I was taking notes and the first time I was taking notes, he came like right up behind me to make sure that I wasn't doing my questions. Like I'm taking notes, bitch. Bye. Um, sorry about my language, but when people aggravate me, I start cussing. I'm sorry. Um, but, yeah, and then I was, like, he was talking about, like, um, he's, like, he seems like he's really supportive of gay people, and if you guys know me, I'm very supportive of gay people. I love, I'm not gonna say I love gay people to death. I don't hate them, and I don't love them. It's just, like, a normal relationship. If I, if you happen to be my best friend and you're gay, I mean, I'm not gonna judge you for it, because you can't handle that. And yesterday in class, he was talking about, he was, like, um... Um, in the book, this reading the metamorphosis and the main character turned to, 
turns into a bug and he was like, relating that to like um you like how people are racist and like his family was neglecting him basically and not liking him because he was a bug and he was basically talk, relating that to racist like oh um like people are racist towards black people or white people whatever race you are but you can't control your race um they're sexist you can't control your gender and then he was like or that like, you're gay and you're gay or straight and people like you can't control being gay or straight and i was like oh my god yes boy preach but he's still annoying i still hate that uh, the heck out of him um having an effect like liking gay rights still has nothing to do with your um with your personality i guess but um so i was like he was talking about that in class i was like oh i should add that to my my answer that's a really good like thing i don't know why i did that and then he saw me like because i sit in the very first center front center row seat why did i choose that i don't know because basically in a first day of school i was trying to choose seats that were very close to the board so i can see the board in every single class because i had to struggle last year trying to see the board and not being able to so i didn't want that to happen this year and so i sat very front and i didn't know that he doesn't really use his board often i should have sat in the very back but his buddy mark did and he's really smart so shout out to you mark you were smart and a lot of people did that actually but um um so i was writing and i was like i was like oh yeah like his family neglected him like some like a lot of the times gay people when they come out to their family their family neglects them and he like snatched my paper and he was like and then after the end of class he was like yeah we're just gonna stop talking now because he like talks about the books the chapter when we read it he talks a ton and he was like yeah we're just gonna stop talking now because people are not in it and people are answering questions on their paper when they know they're not supposed to and obviously he was talking about me but apparently, apparently he took up this other boy's paper and i didn't feel so like mm. but he's just freaking annoying everyone hates him he gets my nerves i was just adding something to my page and then my friend and i said because i couldn't read what he was writing i'm too blind for that he wrote minus five which psh, I don't give a shit. He's probably not gonna put that grade in anyway. So I need to get to my nerves, and that just ruined my whole day. Third and fourth period um, is math, and I actually was um, doing my work and stuff. And then I I, I can't see the board from where I sit, so I had to put my glasses on. And my glasses, like after, I don't know why, but I'm gonna blame it on my glasses. Maybe it's not my glasses, but I just got the hugest headache after because I don't wear my glasses often. And so I got a headache because I was wearing my glasses, or maybe right now I have a headache because I'm not wearing my glasses. That might be it, but, um, yeah, because I wore my glasses the whole period because I couldn't see the board and I just kind of liked wearing them, but, um, yeah, and then the rest of the day was normal. Well, in Spanish, my head start, started hurting even more because my tutor wasn't here and she decided to give us work that we haven't even learned, and so I was, like, trying to use Google Translate and I just was not having it. I was like, my head hurts. I can't do this, and so I stopped in that, and it would test in history, and band was just annoying because I had my head hurt, so, I don't know. That was my day. My day was not the best day out of my life. But it wasn't the worst. Oh, also today we have advisory on Wednesdays, and I forgot all about that. And my friend walked. I mean, my friend and I walked like how we normally do. We walked all the way down this hall. I can't explain it. You guys don't go to. My, you guys most likely don't go to my school, so I can't explain it. But basically, I was so confused. I walked in my classroom. I was like, because it's in between two classes. It's in between second period and third period. And last year, um, I had a block for second and third period, which means like at one class for both of those periods, and um. So in the middle of the class on Wednesdays, we had to leave. And so um, we, I don't have that anymore. And I forgot that that was Wednesday. And I walked to my class. And I said, she has a senior advisory. So I walked in there. I was just like all confident and stuff. And I looked. I was like, huh? And I just like, oh my god, this is advisory. Oh my god, oh my god. And I just walked out and went to my class. I felt so dumb. But yeah, that was my day in a nutshell. If you guys like, I can't vlog at school all the time. But if you guys actually want to watch more vlogs, check out my Snapchat. My Snapchat is basically Ashley. Um, names right here. I always do that. And it's like all the way down here or something because I don't know how much of my face is showing. But I don't know. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, how I shattered my iPhone, and how bad my day was today. Um, I hope to see you guys tomorrow. Bye!